Hello everybody, my name is Maddie and I am going to be filling in today. Um, this week's topic is about sports in general, how sports impacted me and things like that. So I'm just going to head into that. So sports in my transition, I've I've been in compet uh, I've been in dance and I've ran track. Those are the only two type of sporty things that I've done. Um, I've wanted to play volleyball, but a lot of things are like gender oriented, and I don't feel comfortable with the guys. And they would make me go over there. So that brings me to the next part of this. I think that trans people are more affected by the decisions of making it not all unisex and separating them because us trans people we don't know where to go like we want to go with our rightful gender but they make us go with the gender that we were born with our biological gender and hang out with them and we're not comfortable in that situation they don't look as trans athletes as just you know look it's her she she needs to um be on the girl team when really they go off of what your biological gender is and put you on the guy team because you have not had no type of surgery with your um you have not had your vaginoplasm so you have not had your sex change so you're still biologically a male and you're still regarded to go use that along with a lot of bathrooms as well now that we're getting to this topic, um, bathrooms are separated like that too. So I think a lot of things are like really separated for trans community. Me as myself, I'm not really a sporty person. Like literally all I'm doing right now is dance and it's still kind of separated. But I'm so thankful to have a dance class that's so unisex and has so much variety of people in it. So to basically sum up like all my thoughts is... I think that trans youth in the schools, um, we are separated so much between boy and girl, and we're not able to be with our rightful gender as much as, you know, other states probably do. I know here in California, we are now legally able to go and join our gender affiliated sports but I don't know how it is over in the other states so yeah um I just believe that passionate in it fight for yourself go of a fight for yourself with it be comfortable in your skin if you really want to do the sport and you and you want to be comfortable, go tell them that you really want to do the sport. Show them your abilities first because if you show them your abilities, you're able to do more things. And I know, like, they say men are more masculine than women because it's scientifically proven. But you see, these transsexuals were on hormones, so... Our bodies change. It's no longer that male body or that female body. We're changing our genders. And that's what I think they should put more focus on. So yeah, that's basically my rant. I will see you guys all later and bye. Being masculine also year I up and expressing my so masculinity. It was a skateboard it was a space where I learned me. I how to be confident. I actually stopped for about 10 years and, and then got back into it last year.